Albuquerque Police Department is being sharply criticized for its new use of force policy, saying it is confusing to officers. That's just one part of a report released today by the Federal Monitor in charge of overseeing changes to the department. Action 7 News reporter Kirsten Swanson got the chief's reaction. You know, and Doug, you'll remember this whole reform process started when the Department of Justice found that APD officers at times were using too much force during those encounters. Chief Eden today tells me he's seeing changes every day in his department. In case after case, incidents involving use of force have plagued the Albuquerque Police Department. But when the city signed a settlement with the Department of Justice for reform, Chief Gordon Eden says his leadership took on the task to fix how officers encounter situations. We just have to get better at what, what we're doing and let's figure out the, uh, a way to do it. But this week, the federal monitor released his fourth report reviewing the progress APD has made. In it, he criticized the updated use of force policy, saying the team charged with reviewing incidents wasn't following the new rules, specifically that supervisors at times used carefully worded excuses, apparently designed not to find fault with officers' actions. And I think what happened was is that there was some misunderstanding by some of our supervisors on what exactly they were supposed to do. Since then, Chief Eden tells us the leadership is taking steps to correct their behavior and will require investigators meet specific expectations when looking at a use of force claim. But for the most part, Eden says, What I see every day is better and better and better and better results from every one of our citizen encounters. Dr. Ginger did comment in that report that APD is on track and meeting deadlines. We're about four and a, that we're about halfway through rather this four year process, reform process. Live in downtown Albuquerque, Kirsten Swanson, KOAT Action 7 News.